I have two unfinished wood blocks. My first large one here measures three and a half inches. And I'm going to paint the entire thing using some Wise Owl Bowie paint. Now, of course, you could pick any colors that match your home decor. My second block is two and three quarters of an inch. And this one I'm going to paint in Wise Owl Antique Villa. And this was actually the insert to a box from the Dollar Tree. So it does have an opening on the back side. I have another square piece of wood and a rectangular piece of wood and I'm going to glue them together. And I'm going to paint that using the Wise Owl chocolate. The square piece of wood I got from the Dollar Tree pre-cut to that size and the other piece was just scrap wood. I have these fall stencils, they came from the Dollar Tree as well. And I'm going to cut out the one that says Hello Fall and I'm going to place it on the front of my large block. This is a sticky stencil, so it sticks down. And I'm going to use Wise Owl Mandarina to fill in the Hello Fall. I'm using a sponge foam dabber as well. And I'm going to lift that up. These work really nice. If you keep them nice and clean, you should be able to reuse them. On my other box that we painted in Antique Villa, I'm going to create a face. I'm going to start with the two eyes a squiggly mouth, and a little triangle nose. I'm using my Sharpie paint markers to add the face to the white block. And you can get creative as you'd like, adding as much detail as you'd like. I'm going to keep mine nice and simple for now. On the two pieces of wood we glued together, I'm going to add some raffia and a little sunflower, and this is going to be the hat. And at this point, we can start gluing our pieces together. I'm going to glue the hat on top of the face. And I am going to dry brush a little bit of Wise Owl chocolate to the white. And then you can use a piece of sandpaper to just tone it down a little bit. But I like the distressed look. You can certainly skip that step if you do not like that. I'm then going to glue the face on top of the Hello Fall block. And I'm just using hot glue to adhere everything in place. I'm going to add just a little bit of detail to the bottom block. And since I gave everything a nice sanding, I'm going to give it a little top coat of the Wise Owl Furniture Salve, and this is just going to help brighten that paint back up. I'm then going to take more raffia, and I don't want to make this permanent just yet, so I'm using a piece of painter's tape. And I'm going to braid on the left and just tie a piece of jute at the end, and then braid on the right, keeping them about the same length, and then tie another piece of jute. Trim up the hair, and at this point, I can glue that down, and you can leave the braided pieces sticking out, but I'm just going to add a little bit of hot glue and glue it right onto the edge of the bottom block. And this was so easy. Most of this stuff all came right from the Dollar Tree. I really hope you enjoyed it. Paint products, tissue paper, transfers, mesh stencils, wood cutouts can all be found at chocolatefancy.com. Have a great day.